Hello guys. So in case you are trying to export your video in Premiere Pro, you can see this is my timeline. And if I click on export, no matter you export 1080p, 4K, any format, if you click on export, the time keep increasing. Normally, this is only 14, 15 minutes of timeline. It's not that big. I have this steady headshot and not so much thing on the timeline. And you can see here, it's showing two hours, 56 minutes. I'm using i7 H processor with RDX 3070 graphics card. So it's a really good graphics card and it never took so much time. And you can see one hour, 42 minutes. And by the time it will keep increasing and usually it does not take so much of time. Okay. Let me tell you what's happening. So I watched a lot of videos and people give a lot of suggestion to change the graphics card configuration and a lot of other stuff encoding. No, nothing matters. What do you need to understand? You see here, this red line, this red line means that this part is very hard to render. It might render, it will take hours and hours. It might render, but it's really, really hard to render. And you have to see what you are doing here, which is making this so hard to render. You can see, this is red part here and here you can see this is yellow part here. So this is much easier to render. And you see what I'm doing here. If I click on, for example, just let's see here on this one. What I'm doing here, I'm using this effect. It's called paint bucket. You can see paint bucket effect, which is applied on this thing, which is making it red. If I just remove this paint bucket, there's one and two, you can see it directly turned to yellow. And I have this paint bucket effect everywhere on all the clips. You can see if I scroll here, I have this paint bucket effect. So let's do one thing. I remove paint bucket effect from all my clip. So now you can see I've removed everything, only just this one. Let's do one thing from here. I also remove this one. Now you can see it's all timeline is yellow. If now I try to export it, if I click on export, and then if I click on 4K export, you can see now it's showing less than nine minutes. And I'm sure with my graphics card, my computer and everything, it will export the complete video within like five minutes. So you need to find the effect which is making your timeline complicated. If it is red here, this effect, you need to change it. In my case, I was using paint bucket outside the my image to bring the border. Instead, what I can do, instead what I did, I just draw a shape outside my image. That's it. So it brings the safe effect. So try to find the alternative way and make sure it is yellow. If you like the video, if you get any help from this video, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel and watch this other useful video on your screen.